and add transitive verbs? Take, uh, yes, uh -huh. take is transitive verb. I take you. And take you. Hmm. Ah, to say llevarte. Ajá, Yo, o llevarla contigo. With you. Ah, llevarla. Ah, and USB. take take it with you. Exactly. Take it with you. Much yes. better. Excellent, girl. Good job. I like that example. Uh -huh. You could put your software in a USB and take it with you. Excellent. Yamil, I have... I have pain in my, in my back. What do you think it would be a good idea to do? Mm. It, it would be a good idea to, um, to go to the doctor, to a doctor. To go to the doctor. Uh-huh. Very nice. Good job. Okay. Just guess more. We I need ideas to I need ideas for the graduation of the group. Use the next expression to give me suggestions. It will be a good idea idea. It would be a good idea to... Oh, the next expression was let's, because Yamil oh. used that Sorry. one. Sorry. Uh, let's, let's give them a... Let's give them a... Um, I, I don't know how to say... Uh, how do you say diploma? Oh, yes. Diploma. <laughs> In English, the name is Diploma. Only with English pronunciation. Diplo. Diploma. Diploma? Mm. Di diploma? Mm. The short sound? Di di diploma? Exactly. Diploma. 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 Complete. Let's give them a diploma. Good idea. Very good. Very, very good. Next. Karen. Um, let's go for tacos. Mm. I am hungry. And I need to use if you want. Yes. Oh, yeah. I if need you to use Karen, <laughs> I need yes, I need to use if you want. If you want, if you want a tacos, mm, tacos is plural. If you want uh, some tacos, eliminate some. Uh, if you want want tacos, exactly. Uh -huh. If you want tacos. You need to pay for me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. That's a, that doesn't Fight sound me. like a suggestion. <laughs> okay, okay. That's a good idea. <laughs> no problem. Perfect. Rox, what do you say if... Um, what do you say if... I need to change the schedule of your class. What um, will happen? I think that you're actually... No, I think that you... You schedule. Mm -hmm. It's great. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. <I agree. laughs> Yes, I think it doesn't need to change. Yes. <laughs> Excellent. Nice. And the last one, Yamil. Um, the, the casting is this weekend, but I haven't practiced. But I really want to do it. Hmm. 
I we I guess sorry. Uh, you should cast. Mm -mm. No. Casting is not a verb, and cast is not a verb. I mean, it's a verb, but when mm -hmm. a, the director casts another person, I don't cast. Mm. Uh huh. Mm, I guess you should go for the cast. For the cast. What's the name of the ceremony when you... Casting. Exactly. Eliminate okay. four, connector for destination. Connect to the cast. To the cast. To the what? To the casting, sorry. Ah, uh, casting. Right. Complete idea. Um, I guess you sh you should. Oh, I forget, forget. Um, you should try to go for the casting. No, Excellent. I for yes, okay. Yes or no? no you I, I, I forgot. <laughs> I, I add one verb. But add it. Past. Add it. Right. Add it. Right. Yes, you did. So complete. One, two, three, action. I guess you should try to go to the casting. Perfect. Very, very good. Well, my people, these are only some examples on how to detect suggestions. Because we are going to eliminate said, told, and ask. And we are going to replace this word with the following verbs. When you detect a suggestion, you are going to use should. But in a very specific methodology. Observe this example. Here, uh, Jesse Solis, please read the example that you have in front so we can start the analysis. Why don't, why don't we have breakfast next Monday, Jerry? Thank you very much, yes. For context, yes, we are going to transform this into a gossip. And for this, okay. we are going to follow specific steps. Step number one, find the real suggestion. With the real suggestion, you mean the verb. The verb that is being suggestive. The verb in the suggestion. Which one is it? Who can tell me? Have breakfast. Perfect. Yeah. Have breakfast. Step two, now that you have your, your suggestion, we are going to convert it into a person verb complement sentence using should. Use should and transform it into a complete idea. The person should verb and complement. Similar to Formula 7 for A, all the models. No? What is this transformation? Uh, Jesse Casmore, use this information and transform it into a should. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's why. Um, we should have breakfast next Monday. Excellent. We should have breakfast next Monday. Now, with this information, you can activate the gossip structures. And this is going to happen. Now, you are ready to use the following formula. The person suggested that transformation for we? They? They, very good, yes. They. Because it's Jerry and and uh, and another person, no? Mm -hmm. Jerry suggested that they should They should have Aha uh -huh. Compliment Breakfast the next Monday. You included the, 
and we uh, never had that eliminate that they should have breakfast next monday very good final gossip he suggested that they should have breakfast next monday of course all of this is optional but this is for perfect for better punctuation if you want a better score in your final exam this is the correct form to speak follow better structures make better structures not only be one try to extend to be two do you have any question and uh, i have one question so in this case we should use the word should and all the uh, all the gossip and and when well, no. In, su in suggestion, gossip? Of gossip. course, because a suggestion is a should. A should is a suggestion and, and vice versa. Okay, so in, in all the um, suggestion examples, we are going to transform them only for should. Uh -huh. Because the, okay. only, the only model that exists for okay. recommendations is should okay we have shall too but shall is for formal suggestions and only for for i and we so if you talk to another person like for example she you cannot use shall but in this case um maybe we could use shall or no or if if jerry mm. uh, uh, had talk um, to you to me uh -huh. Uh -huh. if Jerry talked to you okay but that's over yes. over complicating everything okay you know okay, okay. that's that that turns out to be unnecessary if it's okay a recommendation first find the suggestion and if you detect the suggestion you should okay perfect mm -hmm. Thank you. Let's practice. In this structure, I have two different formulas. The person suggested that, or the person suggested to. This connector to and not to is usually used when you are talking about a simple verb. For example, my mom suggested to, to, close the window in the night. You see, I am not using should because this is not a complete idea. You have the two options. You select. Are you ready to practice? Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> okay. In that case, I can help you. I will guide you. I have... Let's going to call it like this. For suggestions, we have option one. And here you have option two. There we go. So option one, you have this message. Why don't you get a mechanic? Oops. Why don't you get a mechanic to look at the car? Tell me, Rox, what is the suggestion in this sentence? With that structure? Um, what do you mean with that? Ah, no, no, no. First, detect the suggestion there. Ah, uh, get a mechanic. Excellent. Get a mechanic to look. At the car. At the car. Very nice. 
Now that you have this information, transform it into option one. Mm. Emma suggested mm -hmm. that that um, he Emma is a girl. Ah. Uh, but the person that get a mechanic is a uh, is a Emma. Yes. Ah, uh, okay. Mm. Emma suggested. Mm -hmm. uh, um, Someone. Mm, okay. Uh huh. Someone. That. That a sheep should get a mechanic to look at the car. No? Oh, okay. Someone. I I understand your question now. Uh, let's imagine she's talking to you. Sorry. Let's imagine she's talking to you. Ah, okay. Ah, uh, Emma suggests me. Suggest in present or in past? Uh, suggested in past. Yes. Emma suggested me. Uh huh. Eliminate that, me. Oh, suggested that she should. She should get a mechanic to look at the car. Mm, I, I, so, I'm, conf I'm confusing because I don't know who, who, oh, who is Emma talking. She is talking to you. With me. Uh -huh. And she, she is, is told me that. Yes. Yes, correct. What okay. I noticed is that it's incorrect to say suggested me because that's not a transitive verb, you know? Okay. That's pretty eh, interesting. Okay. Emma suggested mm -hmm. eh, that I should. Aha, uh -huh. correct. Okay, that I should get a mechanic to look at the car. Yes, that's correct. Totally. We are talking about Emma suggesting that you, because the why don't you speaks to you, about you. This you is Rox. Yes, teacher. Mm -hmm. What happens if I use the mechanic, because the mechanic is a person too, Yes. Try to do it. Mm. Let, me, well, let me open the my door because it's too hot. I hear you. Come on. But with what? What happens if you consider that the mm -hmm. mechanic takes the suggestion? Take the, the mechanic as a as a person included. Um, Emma suggested uh -huh. that uh, we eliminate we. Who is going to look at the car? Who I. Mm -mm. You are not an expert in this case. In the yes, car. The, the mechanic is expert. Exactly. This can be your person too. Mm -hmm. He? He he or she, but say it explicitly. The, oh the mechanic? Exactly. Eliminate that because we are not talking about a specific uh, mechanic. Me mechanic, okay. Emma suggested that mm -hmm. mechanic. Mm, how many mechanics? That's countable. A mechanic. 
Yeah, complete. Emma suggested that a mechanic mm -hmm. um, should mm -hmm. look mm -hmm. at the car. Exactly. That's another option. Okay. That's that's the reason I tell you that English and the language language is are flexible. You just need to find the correct person and associate the correct verb. In the first example, should get because it's the recommendation for I. In the second example, should look because the recommendation is for the mechanic. Okay, teacher. You see? That is good. This example is only for option one. Okay. Let's try now with option one and two. Let's go with mm -hmm. Karen. Detect the suggestion. I'll read the next suggestion. Jerry's. Jerry's suggestion. Sorry, teacher. Uh, it could be a good idea to see a doctor. Uh -huh. Pronunciation. Would, not could. Could. Uh -huh. It could be a good idea to see a doctor. Good. Action. The, the Use first option, option one, exactly. Um, Imagine Jerry's, Jerry is speaking to you, similar okay. to Rox. Jerry su su chet, suggested. Pronunciation. Uh, it's Jerry. not su. Suggested. Exactly. Okay. Suggested. Okay. Jerry, Jerry suggested mm -hmm. that I mm -hmm. no, that uh, that I will be that or I don't know <laughs> that it it will be a good idea to see a doctor. Um. Okay. So in the previous list, we have these expressions that, that to the text suggestions, no? Yeah. And here we have, it would be a good idea to. Okay. This is not a message. Okay. You see? Yes. You can include it, but it's too much information. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, teacher. So let's try again. Um, Jerry suggests, no, suggested mm -hmm. that uh, that will be a good idea to see a doctor. Mm, avionazo. <laughs> Un avión. Listen to this. You know. I repeat, <laughs> the expression, it would be a good idea, is not the message. No. And when you gossip, eliminate unnecessary, unnecessary expressions, like wow, like welcome, like nice. Do you remember that what happens to these expressions? Mm, yes. What happens to these expressions? We need to um, eliminate. <laughs> Omit them. Omit it. Uh -huh. Omit them. You don't need them because that's not the principal message. Okay. So find the message. What is the message in this case? Uh, see a doctor. See a doctor. Exactly. Uh, okay. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> Jerry suggested that I mm -hmm. should yes. see a doctor. Never use to with should. Never, 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 never. I should see a doctor. Yes, that's Sorry. correct. 
came and Jerry suggested is that that I should see a doctor. That's correct. Do you see it? Sorry. Do you see it? Do you have any question about this? No. No. I okay. got it. <laughs> perfect, perfect, perfect. If you don't understand, Karen, mm -hmm. I prefer that you say, you know what? Go back. Yes, One because in yes, because in the third, the first option will be a good idea. Is with the it's with the phrase included, or I don't know. Because this is the principal idea, it's to see a doctor, yes, because it's not necessary to use another part. Uh -huh. Because it would be a good idea, it's similar to say should. Uh, okay. So now you are duplicating information. If you use should, or you use should, or you use this expression. You know? Mm, okay. Only one. Okay, teacher. Yes, I got it. That's it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Jesse Solis, how would you gossip this using option two? Jerry suggested uh -huh. um, to see to I see a doctor. Eliminate I. In the formula, you don't have an I. You don't have a person. Okay. Jerry suggested mm -hmm. to see a doctor. Exactly. And we don't need to say to say that C5 6 Jerry suggested to see a doctor any question I have a question. Yes, please. Um, for all suggested, uh -huh. uh, we should use should. Yes. Only should? Only should because that's the only model that exists for recommendations. Okay. Also exists uh, shall, but that is um, only for formal settings and only for we and I. Okay, teacher. Very good. All right. To finish this lesson, observe the synonyms that you can use to eliminate suggested. You can say advised. You can say proposed. You can say offered. You can say recommended. Any of this can replace suggested. You have a lot of options. Take a screenshot. Actually, let me find, let me send a screenshot to you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, seven, 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 seven. Next, eliminating a suggestion. Now we are going to see what happens when you are requesting for things. And when do you request? You request and you ask when you go to the restaurant. Okay, this is what happens when you make a petition. A person asked, and then you are going to use connector for. Connector for is for the things that we ask. For example, over here. Can I have an apple? In this case, Emma is asking for an apple. Asking as a petition, eh? not question. When you make a petition, you ask. That's the second definition for ask. 
Do you understand ask in this context? Okay. Yes, like yes. a petition. Exactly. A petition. So Yamil, how would you gossip what Emma said? Mm, Emma asked for an apple. For an apple. It's easy as that. Emma asked for an apple. Perfect. Jessica Asmore, how would you gossip what Jerry asked? Jerry asked for sugar. Perfect. Jerry asked for sugar. And the other option is when you ask and then for a verb. If the petition is a verb, you can use the formula that is similar to the previous expression. Just a verb. Connector to or not to. In the example, can you lower the volume, please? What is the verb? This is Olis. Can you lower the volume, please? Find the verb. Lower? Correct. The word is lower. Let me make it in color green, okay? Lower is a verb. 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 So, give me the gossip. Uh, Jesse, Jesse Solis. Um, we asked, right? We asked exactly. Yes. Uh, my dad uh -huh. asked uh -huh. for the. Okay, sorry, my uh, my. That asked to to lower mm -hmm. the the I have pronounced volume. Mm -hmm. volume. Yesterday we saw this. Yes. Uh huh. Mm. I. By uh, uh, this is not I. This is not a symbol. This is only a, a separation. Va. Va. Val. Val. Yes. Repetition. Volume. 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 Complete. Volume. My my dad asked mm, to ask him fast. Sorry. Ask. Ah, okay. <laughs> my dad asked to lower the volume. Exactly. My dad asked to lower the volume. This is how to how to gossip a request. You see, we can eliminate said, told, and ask. And you can use all the structures. Where are you for the structure? Seven. And finally, the same to and not to can be used to talk about orders and imperative verbs. Let me take this into a, like this, so you don't see the answers. And this is going to be your homework. Fortunately, you didn't catch the answers. Ha 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 ha. Homework. Okay. At the end, we have finally checked all the seven 
gossip transitions that we need to learn to pass this level. Uh, look at this master, master screen. All the gossip in only one shot. Oh, yes. <laughs> anyway, there you have it, my people. Do you have any question? Mm, no. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Tomorrow, send me your, your, your answers to the previous expression, and we're going to do some practicing with this. Okay? Okay, well, teacher. Thanks, guys. Excellent class. Good I'll teacher. see you tomorrow. Thank you, teacher. See you tomorrow. Thanks, teacher. Ciao. Bye, guys. You too. Good night. See you later. Good night. Bye.